All right, so the next thing I'm going to show you, so I've showed you how to get onto your email, how to delete an email. I'm going to show you how to write an email. So if I want to write an email, there is a compose button. So right up here, you see me circling it right now. It's a plus that says compose. So I'm going to press that and it shows up in the corner. Now I can leave it like this and type or I can make it a little bit bigger to fit my whole screen. So when you're typing a message, so remember that this little, these arrow buttons can make it smaller or bigger. I'm going to write a message to Mr. Pedersen. Now this, and this has to be an email that you write in the two. So because I've emailed Mr. Pedersen before, it shows up. Some people might show up, but you might have to know your teacher's whole email address and your family might have to help you figure that out. Um, but I'm going to type to Mr. Pedersen and my subject is going to be, I have a question about math. I type in question about math, then I type a message. You usually start with a greeting. Hi, Mr. P. Then I type my question. My question is, and then I would type my question. Oops. And then at the end of my email, I say, thank you, just to be kind. Thank you. And then I type from Miss O'Leary. Or I can just type my name. This won't show up on yours. So I wrote his email first. I wrote my subject. And then my greeting, my question. And then I'm going to send it. So I'm going to move my little thing over here. Um, there's more features in email, but this is the main important part. So then I'm going to press the bottom, this little blue button that says send. So I'm going to circle that so you can see it. Down here is the send button. So now I'm going to click send. Alrighty, then it should send.